Having spent most of my life in IT, technology always interests me. It needs to be fit for purpose. Uh, we've got three different technologies in front of us. Uh, the first one is a micro display which is in the corner of these uh, snow goggles used for either snowboarding or skiing. It provides information about your speed and everything else. Uh, very useful, but the uh, eye is required to change direction, to move away from where you're going to focus. The focal length is very short to look at the uh, information displayed. So you have to take your eye, in this case, off the snow or off what's ahead. Uh, so you need to be careful about hazards ahead. Google Glass, this is not a micro display, this is a prism display. Um, again, you need to take your eye away from wherever you're travelling, whether you're walking or whatever, to focus on the information. From a technical point of view, uh, a prism display is generally not as bright as a projected display or as a micro display. Uh, useful for the purpose for which it was designed, uh, but I would not use it um, as a motorcyclist whilst I was out riding. This is um, a projected display, it's a true head-up display that you look through and the focal length here is, I don't know how the technology has done it, but it's projected as though it's about four meters away. So you don't need to take your eyes to look down, as in both of these instances, you're looking straight through and you don't change your focal length. The technology is used um, for aviation, for fighter pilots in the military. It's also used um, in top of the range cars like BMW. So the, the design has already been carried out, the testing has already been carried out and it's been proven. The head up display is much better and fit for purpose for the use of motorcycling. This will be my option.